In this video, I'll show you how to use Bookmap to view market data and trade the Binance Cryptocurrency Exchange. Note that while viewing the data is free, for trading a Digital Plus package and a Binance account are required. Let's connect to the three Binance connections, Binance, Binance US, and Binance Futures. The first step is to make sure we have the adapters installed and then establish the connection. Click on Settings, then Manage Plugins. Make sure that the Binance, Binance US, and Binance Futures plugins are installed. If you don't have the adapters installed already, scroll down to find the list of adapters that are not installed and install it. If you had to install the adapter, please restart Bookmap. If you didn't, like me, you can continue. Now, after checking we have the plugins installed, let's establish the connection. Click on Connections, then Configure and Add a Connection. Then in the Platform drop-down window, select Binance, then Add Connection. We'll do the same process with Binance US and Binance Futures. Binance consists of two exchanges, the international variant and the US variant. The international variant is split across spot instruments and futures instruments. I'll show you how to connect to all three. Click OK. Now let's go back to connections and enable our new connection. The next step is to add an instrument. Click on the plus tab, choose Binance under the platform and ETH USDT, for example, as the symbol. Let's do the same with Binance US and Binance Futures. Now that we established all the connections and added the instruments, let's go over how to trade through Bookmap with Binance. We'll start with the international exchange. First, let's disable all connections. Open Binance.com, log in, and over over the profile icon to go to API management. The next step is to create a new API key. Click Create API, then System Generated, and Next. Now we have to create a label. For example, my first bookmap key. Drag the slide. Enter the code you got on email and your authenticator application and click submit. After creating the API key, we'll edit the restrictions. Let's click on edit restrictions here. We have to set a trusted IP where this API key can be used from. Click on Restrict Access to Trusted IPs Only. Having a static IP is the ideal scenario. If you don't have a static IP, you may be required to change the IP every time it changes, which could be as frequent as every day. How can you find out what your IP is? Open a new tab and search iconizip.com. Here you can find your IP. Copy and paste it here, then click Confirm. After doing that, we can now edit the restrictions. Let's enable spot and margin trading. Click Save and input the authenticator code. Our next step is to copy the API key and go back to Bookmap, then Connections, Configure, and Binance. Check Enable Trading and paste the API key here. Do the same with the API secret key. Click OK, go back to Connections to enable Binance. I already selected an instrument. On the chart that opened, open the Trade Control Panel by clicking on the Padlock icon. Select how you want to trade, choose the size of your order, and place it. For more information on trading with Bookmap, click the links in the description. Now we can trade with Binance. We'll do the same thing for the futures exchange and create a new API key that will have the futures permissions. Click Create API, then System Generated and Next. Let's create a label, for example, my first bookmap futures key. Drag the slide, insert the code you got on email and your authenticator application and click Submit. Now click on Edit Restrictions, then Restrict Access to Trusted IPs Only. 
type in your IP. If you don't know it, check this website and copy it from there. Click Confirm, then check Enable Futures and save. Input the Authenticator code. Our next step is to copy the API key and go back to Bookmap. Click on Connections, then Configure, and then Binance Futures. Check Enable Trading and paste the API key here. Do the same with the API Secret key. Click OK, go back to Connections to enable Binance Futures. I already selected an instrument. On the chart that opened, open the Trade Control Panel by clicking on the Padlock icon. Select how you want to trade, choose the size of your order, and place it. For more information on trading with Bookmap, click the links in the description. Now you can trade with Binance Futures as well. Currently, we don't support Binance US trading on Bookmap, only viewing the market data. So to trade, you'll need to use the Binance US webpage.